like I said, it's a quick and general reading. Um, Sagittarius, you have beautiful, strong grounds. But I want to say for some of you, if you're single and your love is coming in or you are renewing it, and this could be with even in general relationships. This is like, I want to say a renewal, um, feeling better, um, emotional validation, something, you know, it's like a new emotional path, I want to say. But there is an energy here of some of you. It could be a kind of like still... It's almost like you feel guilty to move forward somehow. Um, you know, the example is all your life, just say you're, um, you know, I this has happened to me and some people. It's like you've always bought for your kids, done for your children or other people. And then finally you take care of yourself or you're buying things for yourself and you start feeling, oh, guilty. But you always took care of everyone else. You know what I mean? Um you shouldn't feel guilty about the good in your life or making changes. Uh, so, uh, or whatever it is, this could be just leaving some kind of situation. You're doing what you want to do and it makes you feel good. But at the same time, you're kind of like being hard on yourself. You know, it's, it's like you it kind of, it's a way of beating the self up. So there is that energy. That's for some of you there, but it's time to move on. It's like, it's a new beginning. For some of you, this is, um, I see that you, um, this is a new spiritual path, meaning you could be um, joining a new group, religion, or it's a new way of thinking. It's a new interest. Whatever it is, it's following the heart. So that's really good there. And it's going to bring you some kind of luck. Because what I feel for some of you, this is the Harbinger Week. And this is going to start to long-term energy where you're kind of ending an era. You're kind of in the new, you're in a new beginning. This could be a total career change. Um, something is, you're coming to some big endings and once you step over that and there could be some challenges, you're actually headed on something that's going to be uh, valuable, that's going to kick off a new um, era. <laughs> All right, I guess that's the best I can explain it. You have to follow your gut feeling this week, okay? And if there is any kind of situation that's going on and it could be confusing, just trust your instincts because they are heightened, okay? These are like psychic little hits and it's going to help guide you. And this is through business deals, work, settlements, negotiations, people around you. You know, it works differently for everyone, but it is basically on a path ahead for like uh, career-wise and um, who you can go into business with or not. You know what I mean? Okay. This is a strong week for some of you that, yes, there can be some burdens. There can be some challenges. Things may require extra responsibilities, but this could have been you that also you put things off. It's a, like a life review too. Yes, there's a lot of hard work for some, but you will complete it. You are coming to an ultimate completion. And for some of you, this is your final manifestation of something maybe that you have been manifesting for a long time. Like I said, sometimes be careful what you wish for, what you man manifest, because it may come, but it sometimes doesn't come in the way we want. And it's just clearing the way. But I am seeing here strong realization, strong ending. So a burden in an era is ending for some, okay? I mean, I don't know how else to explain it. And this is simplifying things. And then maybe it's like, when you see all that, you're going to be like, oh, this is so simple now. Why didn't I just do that before? Actually, I've been going through a lot of that lately. It's like I'm a Sagittarius. <laughs> no. Well, I do have my Mars in Sagittarius, so. Hmm. Anyway. Beautiful energy. This is sparkling. This is shiny. These are opportunities. This is for some of you. Uh, you're definitely in the spotlight. You're having fun. This is a good time with children, enjoying your time. Or, you know, playing. It's like your inner child's coming through. Um, you're definitely on, you're headed in the right direction. Okay? So there's a nice shiny sheen here. Uh, you're definitely in the spotlight. This is um, beautiful energy. If you have been kind of down 
or low motivated, whatever it is now, you got this vitality back too. So I do see that, okay? You definitely are going through endings. This is a transitional uh, stage. Something may end. Uh, maybe you've been waiting for some kind of news or something, and it's, go and it's finally coming in. This is like really good news for some, and it's like you get excited about it, so I do feel that energy as well, okay? You do have a lot of earthy energies around you this week. You could be dealing with, um, looks more like Taurus and Virgo, okay? Expect the unexpected. There is a total turn and shift of energy coming through, okay? And this is very fortunate. This is like a whole new cycle commencing, new beginning. Um, this is like open lines of communications. For some of you, maybe you've been wondering about dating again, and you've been holding on to someone because they've been rejecting you. That's another example, um, too. And now it's like you're starting to date again. Um, there's a nice surprising news that may come in too, so this is good. But be careful not to make any promises you can't keep, and also don't you know don't lower your expectations with others because I do feel someone may want to sweet talk you to kind of either keep you hanging and dangling that uh, carrot around, or they promise you things that they don't keep. Okay, so one step at a time here. All right, so you avoid being taken advantage of or used by someone because this could be someone who. Um, knows you have a good heart and they just want to kind of use you or keep you around because they need you. Okay, so I do feel that energy too, unfortunately. All right, you're still bored about some area in your life here and you're going to be kind of contemplating things, okay? But be ready to, when you make your decision to do it or stick with it. Um, I do see here also be careful of any missed opportunities, all right? Um, I do see here you're a little chaotic and a little scattered energies around you. So this is like um, maybe your thought process is kind of on and off this week or you're changing your mind a lot. So I do feel that. 